Welcome to Fashion Through History. In today's episode, we'll take a step back in time and explore the intricate and opulent world of Victorian era fashion. Join us as we delve into the fascinating details of corsets, crinolines, and the ever-changing silhouettes that defined women's clothing during this era. So sit back and prepare to be transported to the elegant world of the Victorian era. The Victorian era, spanning from the early 1830s to the early 1900s, was characterized by its strict social etiquette and elaborate fashion. Women's clothing reflected the societal ideals of modesty, femininity, and refinement. Fashion was seen as a reflection of a woman's status and moral character. The hourglass figure was highly coveted, and fashion played a significant role in shaping and maintaining this ideal. Women's attire consisted of multiple layers, intricate details, and rich fabrics, showcasing their social standing and adherence to societal norms. One of the most defining elements of Victorian fashion was the corset. It was an essential undergarment worn by women of all social classes. The corset tightly cinched the waist and shaped the torso, creating an exaggerated hourglass figure. It was typically made of strong fabric, reinforced with boning, and laced tightly at the back. Corsets were designed to mold a woman's body into the desired shape, emphasizing a slim waistline. However, the tightness and rigidity of corsets often caused discomfort, restricted movement, and even led to health issues such as difficulty breathing and damage to internal organs. In the mid-19th century, crinolines became a prominent fashion trend. These underskirts were made of horsehair or steel hoops and were worn to provide structure and volume to women's skirts. Crinolines allowed skirts to expand dramatically, creating the famous bell-shaped silhouette. The size and fullness of the crinolines varied, with some reaching extravagant proportions. Women adorned these voluminous skirts with layers of petticoats, creating a sense of grandeur and making a fashion statement. Despite the impressive appearance, maneuvering in crinolines required caution and skill to navigate doorways and tight spaces. As the Victorian era progressed, fashion started to evolve, and silhouettes began to shift. Towards the late 19th century, a more natural form known as the S-band silhouette gained popularity. The S-band corset featured a slight forward thrust of the hips and a more relaxed, natural waistline. This style allowed for greater freedom of movement and a more comfortable fit compared to the earlier tightly cinched corsets. The silhouette created a graceful curve, emphasizing the posterior and creating an elegant line from the waist to the hips. With the advent of the S-Bend silhouette, women's fashion embraced a softer, less restrictive style, marking a departure from the rigid corsets and voluminous crinolines. The legacy of Victorian fashion continues to resonate in the modern world. Elements such as corsets, crinolines, and the hourglass silhouette have left an indelible mark on fashion. While the extreme constraints of the era may no longer be prevalent, the opulence, elegance, and attention to detail that defined Victorian fashion remain timeless sources of inspiration. Designers today draw from Victorian aesthetics, incorporating elements such as high collars, lace, ruffles, and intricate embellishments into their creations. Victorian fashion continues to captivate and influence the world of style, serving as a testament to the enduring impact of this era. And there you have it, the mesmerizing world of Victorian era fashion, with its corsets, crinolines, and ever-evolving silhouettes. The women of this era navigated a delicate balance between societal expectations and personal expression through their clothing. Join us next time on Fashion Through History as we continue to uncover the captivating stories behind the fashions of bygone eras. Until then, keep embracing.